Margot Jaffe, 1980, 1981, 1985, College of Dental Medicine. I arrived here when I was 21 years old for graduate school. I was very young. And in my class, uh, we had 12 women out of a class of about 60. Before then, there were one, two, three students that were women, almost no women faculty. So we were sort of like trailblazers. It was hard to find um, mentors. We had to get very mentally tough and perform very uh, well academically and clinically. And I think the person that had the most influence is the current senior uh, associate dean, Dr. Martin Davis, who was a phenomenal teacher, educator, writer, and a motivator. When I was a student here, I was a recipient of financial aid. It made it a lot easier for me that I did not have that debt load when I finished here, and I feel it's very important to give back. I taught both postgraduate pediatric dental students. I taught them orthodontics and sedation. I taught undergraduate pediatric dentistry, and I still continue 30 years later to have a lot of students come through my office. And I always say after a day of spending a day in my office, they know if they want to be a pediatric dentist, an orthodontist, or they want to run away from children. Well, I never really left the university. I think there's only one year I wasn't present at this school in some capacity. Being president of the alumni, I really never saw myself speaking in front of a group. I always was a little uncomfortable, but I sort of found my voice after three years. Receiving the Alumni Medal was one of the best experiences I ever had in my professional career. The reason that I did all these activities and I was so involved in the school was I loved the school and I felt it was my responsibility and duty to give back, but it really did feel good to get an award and to be recognized for it.